<sighs> Man, it's cold. It's been getting so damn cold out there lately. Oh, hi there. I didn't even, um, see you on the couch. <sighs> Don't you also think that it's gotten immensely cold these days? Sheesh, who would have thought it would be getting so cold so quickly? What? You're not cold? You're in fact quite warm there on the couch. Under that nice warm blanket? Yeah, I figured. You do look warm with that nice fluffy blanket. You look so warm and cozy and snuggly. Sorry, what? No, I don't want your blanket. No, don't give me that blanket. I wouldn't want you to be cold. Especially since I know how grimly and bitterly cold it is. You know, out there, without a blanket. No, I don't want your blanket. Then what do I want? Um, nothing. Never mind. No, really, I'm fine. When I say I don't want anything, then I don't want anything. It's fine, really. Uh, um, well... If... If you insist, it was just a thought, really. I just thought that maybe we could... I mean, we don't have to if you don't want to. Um, I just kind of sort of thought that if you didn't mind, that, well, um, maybe we could, uh, share that blanket. We we don't have to if you don't want to. Of course. It was just an idea. I wouldn't want you to... Oh, you're okay with it? You don't have to, you know? In fact, now that I think about it, I'm reasonably sure that I have my own blanket somewhere in my room. And if I would just... Hey! <clears throat> oh, You're so warm. What is it? Oh, yeah, I guess the blanket is a bit small for two people sitting next to each other. Um, do you... Want me to just get up then? No? Because you don't want me to be cold. Oh, you're just being so nice to me. No, don't give me more of your side of the blanket. Well, um, the thing is, well, there would be a solution to her. Blanket problem. Just theoretically? I mean. <laughs> um, what if I, uh. Where to. Well. Where to sit on. You know? If I. Where to sit on your lap? Just for warmth, of course. Yeah, just to optimally utilize the available resources and blanket, um, uh, yardage. Uh, that's a word. Don't laugh. It used to be a word in my days. You would be okay with me sitting on your lap? Y you don't have to, remember? I wouldn't at at any rate, want to force you to. Oh, okay. Okay, 
And now, what are you? Oh, you're wrapping the blanket around us. Oh, this is nice for warmth. I mean, this is very uh, efficient for body transmission. This is a lot better already, but I'm still shivering, well, yeah, it was so bitterly cold out there, but uh, I mean, don't get me wrong, you are doing an incredible job at warming me up already, I by no means intend to refute that, but, what, no, it's fine, I said it's fine. Stop poking me. You always poke me. I am a majestic, fearsome vampire. A mere mortal like you shouldn't be poking me. What? No, you don't only really poke me when I have something I don't want to tell you. You poke me all the time. Yeah? Okay, fine. I just thought that... You know... I would probably warm up a lot quicker if I, I mean, there's, let me say it like this, you are wearing a pretty thick jumper right now, and I mean, of course, why wouldn't you? It's freaking cold there, so you're wearing a jumper. Makes perfect sense, uh, but, uh, well, that jumper is... Well, because it's so thick and fluffy, it's kind of um, thermally insulating, I believe is the term. And well, of course it is. I mean, the whole point of having a jumper after all, right? <laughs> what would you even want with a jumper that isn't thermally insulating, huh? Now, stop it with the poking. Stop it! I'm not beating around the bush. The point I'm driving at is, well, uh, if you were to, you know, just hypothetically take that jumper off so that I could directly snuggle, um, directly draw warmth from your skin, uh, that would be really nice. Just for... Reasons of warmth, of course. Just because of the warmth. Yeah, it would be way more efficient method of a heat transfer. Y you okay with it? <laughs> yes, of course. I'm taking my off as well. It's just as thermally insulating as yours. This is nice. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know I'm cold. Well, technically, I have room temperature, I guess. But I know I feel cold. Are you okay? Do you want to? Oh, you're putting your arms around me. This is really nice. I mean... Warm. It's warm. Yeah, just warm. Nothing else. <sighs> Are you sure you're okay with this? I'm kind of afraid I'm cooling you down too much. I wouldn't want you to catch a cold from, a snuck from warming me up. Oh, I feel a lot warmer already. That's because you're so good at warming me up, sweetheart. Um, uh, buddy, dude, Rumi, stop laughing! <laughs> huh? You want me to turn around? What do you mean? This side of me is done already? You like your vampire roommate's sunny side down? That's good.
kind of Mrs. Dina. <laughs> I don't know exactly how so, but I'm sure I could think of a way it's racist if you just let me. Yeah, my front side is cold as well. But you really don't need to. I mean, if we just stay like this for a bit longer, here under the blanket, I'm quite positive that my front side would be in time warm up from convection. No, but if I turn around, then you would see my face. What? Because it's embarrassing. Uh, okay. What? Yeah? It, this is really warm, I guess. No, I'm not cold anymore. Yeah, it is nonetheless embarrassing. Why? Because you can see my face now, and your face is really close to mine, and you are looking into my eyes, and... Uh, uh, can I maybe just, um... Like, bury my face in the crack of your neck. No, I'm not gonna bite you. It's just... My nose is cold. It always gets super cold when it's like this outside. Sometimes I fear it might freeze off. Plus, you know, I don't do well with eye contact. Oh, thank you. I can feel your heartbeat like this. I mean, I can always hear it because you know vampire scents and scents and stuff. But this up close, I can really feel it. It's almost as if it was speeding inside my chest as well. I kind of like that. I feel so alive. Uh, my device not good. Um, if I just come a bit closer. You know, for warmth. You smell nice. Uh, no, not like that. I mean, you smell acquainted. Oh, wait. What's even worse? Uh, can we just pretend I didn't say anything? Now that... creature of the abyss that feeds them the blood of innocent and souls of the righteous and uh, okay I feast them mostly pizza but that's besides the point but no I'm not trying to get away I'm just leaning back a little why? because our faces are really close right now no, that's not a bad thing. I mean, it's not a bad thing. Bad thing. It's just that... Well, we're roommates and I think we shouldn't be this close to another. What? Yeah, but that doesn't count. You were giving me mouth to mouth. I wasn't conscious at that time, so that doesn't count. What? No, I am happy that you did it. You saved my life and stuff, but to be fair, 
that was kind of your fault my life was in danger in the first place. I mean, what idiot puts garlic on pizza? Anyways, thank you for saving my life though. I remember how I woke up and saw your face so close to mine. And I think it was back then that I first realized that I le- um, that uh, this human dude with someone really fine roommate. Yeah, so thanks again, I guess. Sorry, what? Yeah, my nose is still a little bit cold. Why? You wanna warm it up? Uh, okay, I guess, but how would you? Oh, um, yeah, now that you mention it, I think my lips are cold as well. Really cold, actually. Um, yeah, I would like you to warm them up, please. Um, does that mean that you... Uh, no, forget about it. I know it doesn't mean anything. Forget that I said anything. You're just helping me get warm. You're silly vampire roommate who's always cold. Thanks for letting me sit on your lap. And sharing your blanket for warming up purposes. What? It does mean something? Uh, what does it mean? Oh, come on! No, I don't know. No, it's not obvious. Come on. What do you mean? It means something. You... Love me. Uh... You mean you love me like a really good friend? Okay. Okay, yeah, I got it. You love me, but why me? I mean, I'm just, you know, me. I'm shy and I'm really bad with people. And I'm always cold. And I put half empty blood bags back into the fridge so they drip down on the vegetable drawer. Then you can hold eye contact. Oh. No, I am not blushing. I am not. Stop saying that. What? I didn't answer you yet. Um. <laughs> yeah, I love you too. I, I've loved you the whole time. I love you and I want with you. Can't see it. And how I'm, uh, I mean, uh, it's not like, I mean, if you, uh, I'm sorry, I, I'm not very good at this. Can we maybe just stay like this for a while? Under the blanket. Yeah, this was kind of my plan all along to get to stuck with you. But I had sort of doubt. Thanks for watching the video. Check out the description for the Discord community, and I'll see you there. Please watch another video right here. Ways to support me are in the description as well. Noblesse oblige. Thank you for your continuing service as my subscriber.